from the Rebazons era. Boring! Boring. Uh, uh, no, I uh, said flooring. The flooring <laughs> is lava! Welcome to another episode. 
episode of Before They Were Legends, where we make up totally bogus stories about your favorite stars. Shredder. Plankton. <laughs> Newtman. Yeah! And Krang. Krang. You know them as some of the world's toughest villains. But before they were among the world's most wanted, they were a musical group that no one wanted. That's right. There was a time when they made people scream for a different reason. You're horrible. Be quiet. To make it in the world of music, they tried and failed everything. First, Crane thought they could strike a chord as a barbershop quartet. And when that didn't work, Plankton thought they should pick up a tambourine and spread the love as a hippie band. And just when they were about to give up, Newton got a tip on the upcoming German Oompa band revival that never happened. As time went on, it became clear that this union just wasn't meant to be. And this musical foursome went no more so. Sources say that Newton's wardrobe demands Looking good. Plankton's bad attitude. Clam up! And the Crane's constant need to rewrite lyrics in Crane speak. Crane complicates the complication with greater complications. Some Shredder over the edge. Enough! And the band broke up. Recently, Shredder and Crane came back together for a new collaboration. It seems we have a common enemy. Could this mean a reunion is in the works? Let's hope not. Thanks for joining us on Before They Were Legends. We hope you enjoyed this totally bogus story. Be here next time when we look back at when the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles tried to make it as the Teenage Mutant Ninja Mimes. See you then. And now, it's Patrick's quest for food. My tummy is lonely. Can I go? Let me find me a world's first blood transplant. Will there be nachos there? There must be a baby in the bush. I'm getting a baby. Retrieve. <laughs> next stop, we hawking. Will there be nachos there? Hey, how'd we get up here? My tummy is still lonely. Will there be nachos there? To a Megazord. Will there be nachos there? <laughs> One Krabby Patty, hold the mayonnaise. Hot sauce! Yay! Whipped cream! Jelly relish! I said, no mayonnaise! Uh, approaching lunar surface. Will there be nachos there? Wait, wait, we don't need television. Not as long as we have our imagination!
it, boys! Attention, music lovers! For the first time ever, Deep Sea Records and Bikini Bottom Productions presents Squidward Tentacle's Greatest Hits. <laughs> Feast your ears on his crabbiest, his crustiest, and his most melancholy melodies, like the smash hit, Four Ply. When my tear ducts give issue, I can't use just any tissue. I need Four Ply, Four Ply, Four Ply, when I cry. It's all in one cranky collection, with hits like Squidward style, No Patrick No, Some Squiddy That I Used To Know, and the never before release, SpongeBob Is Leaving. SpongeBob is leaving. Fans everywhere are raving. It's awesome! It's perfect, 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 perfect! So get ready to rock out, Squidward fans! Squidward! Squidward! Rock on, Freaky Bro! Act now and you'll also get a free download of Squidward Super Band, live at the Bubble Bowl, which features the rock anthem, Sweet Victory. So get your tentacles on Squidward Tentacles' greatest hits. This offer doesn't really exist, even though Squidward really thinks it should, and is ready and willing to record the album at any time. Really, just name the time and place and he'll be there. He's waiting by the phone right now, but we can do it for free. Just please, please let him play his clarinet. Is that so much to ask? Hello, and welcome to the 79th Annual Petacular Pet Showdown, where your favorite pets compete for greatest pet of the year. Our first competitor and reigning champion is... Gary the Snail! Look at that poise. No one pulls off a shell like Gary. You can see why he's still undefeated, and he really knows how to charm a judge. Next up, it's newcomer to the scene, ah! Craig the Snake. The varied outfit changes are a nice touch, but watch out for all those chicken wings, Craig. They go straight to your hips. Rub it in my face, why don't you? Now, what do you get when you cross a polar bear with a dog? Naga! 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 Cuddly and adorable, but with a wild side. <laughs> Our next contestant is any turtle's favorite pet. Another turtle! That's right, he's Sewer Magazine's hottest shellback, Spike. Who says reptiles are cold-blooded? This guy really warms my heart. Yeah, I thought so. And last but not least, a talking dog. My bark boy. Bark. Sparky. Known for his amazing tricks and daring stunts, he really puts the spark in Sparky. Watch out! <laughs> wow, what a competition this year, folks. And now, the winner of the 79th Annual Petacular Pet Showdown is... Holy cow! Or should I say holy snail? It's Gary again for the 79th time! Who's judging this competition anyway? That's right! Oh, of course. All right, all right, we get it. We know what the fox says now, but how about some of the world's other creatures? Like, what does the snail say? Ooh, that's not what we learned in science class. Okay, well, what does the rat say? He is a doofus. Yeah! A do -do 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 doofus. Yeah! And you, 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 you need to take a bath. Huh? <laughs> ah, very wise. And what might the duck say? Oh boy! crack. That's different. And what does the snake say? You're a butt 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 You're a butt 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 You're a butt 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 No, I sniff butts on the daily. Daily. Well, that's just kind of gross, but kind of funny. And finally, what if anything does a starfish say? The inner machinations of my mind. Don't it? The inner machinations of my mind. What's not? The inner machinations of my mind. Rabbi Pat. The inner machinations of my mind are an enigma. I don't think any animal would really say that. Would they? Please, no interruptions. The inner machinations of my mind are an enigma. Ice cream! Maybe we should have just stuck with the fox. Hey, what's so fair? It's Face Off with Patrick versus Michelangelo in Battle of the Braves. Pizza? Well, I'm no doctor, but I don't think squirrels are supposed to be blue. Check it out. It sounds hollow when I do this. Uh, I would like two extra cheesy nachos with a side of cheese. You're not listening to me! Did you just slap me? Mommy, <laughs> want more? And the winner is. Let's call it a draw. <sighs> I wish this moment could last forever. And now, breadwinners go around the world in 80 grains. I taste anything better than worms and algae, but this is amazing! Hookshot! In your bait! Release the loaves! Uh oh, that's not good. Hookshot! Awesomeness! Hookshot! Oh my nose! Did you eat the big sauce? Totally! Oh my nose! Another satisfied customer! Release the loaves! What's that, Gary? It's the best food you've ever had? Yeah, this is delicious! Does it have any side effects? Only that is that, Jen. Woo! When SpongeBob SquarePants first came on the scene, he took the world by storm. And what did audiences respond to most? It was his iconic laugh. But before the world's most famous sponge was cast, we first tried out some other characters. It was all about nailing the laugh. Craig the Snake, auditioning for the role of SpongeBob. Take one. <laughs> I'm sorry, is that a laugh or do we need to call a doctor? Next. Cosmo. So Cosmo, whenever you're ready. <laughs> sorry, the laugh is all wrong. Thanks anyway. Okay, you can stop now. Next. Rabbits. Right, that was more of a scream. We're gonna need a laugh. I'm not 
sure you're understanding me. Uh, next, Shredder. Okay, Shredder, is it? Yes. Well, you're up next. At last. Okay, let's hear your most lovable laugh. <laughs> Whoa, now I just peed my pants. Thanks a lot. Rest of a crinkle. <laughs> next. <laughs> next. <laughs> Whoa, next. <laughs> All right, better, better. Uh, okay, one at a time. One at a time, please stop. Hello, can you hear me? Hello, oh, help here. Okay, I'm going to need you to think happy, fun. Can you do that? Yes. I think you're onto something there. Oh, can I hear it again? <laughs> oh, another pair of underwear, please. Who's next? <laughs> It's Craig's Quest for Cool! Do something cool! Do something cool! I'm saying... Wait! Do something cool! <laughs> Dude, you just popped in my face! Cool! Sweet! Cool! Do something cool! Huh, what are you doing? Yeah, cool! 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 What about a couple of babies? Yeah, cool! Do something cool! <laughs> That's still not cool! A fake ad for a product that would never exist, ever. Is your life boring? And she's really beginning to pick up some speed here. Do you need some pep in your step? I just need a quiet place. Yeah. Then start your day the mutastic way with Mutajo cereal. Yeah. Mutajos help you maintain a youthful glow. I've never felt so alive. Take care of your hygiene. <laughs> and assist an old lady crossing the street. Why don't you walk yourself across the street? Or not. Mutajos turn your milk green and your mouth green. Ooh. And your entire neighborhood green! Mutagios are packed with all the essential nutrients, like radiation, toxic waste, bananas, and of course, mutagen! Mutagios! Yeah. The breakfast of mutations! Mutagios may cause upset stomach, loss of bladder control, random acts of yelling, constant itching, temporary burping, perpetual tongue shaking, and frequent falling over absolutely nothing. And by nay, we mean definitely. But other than that, they're green! And part of this complete bogus breakfast. We told you this was totally bogus, right? Roar! I'm a witch! Yeah, and I can dance real good, so let's do it that! <laughs> Give it money away. 
way. I just made more money than I know what to do with. Squidward's most embarrassing moment. Okay, and would you like cheese on... Here again, autumn. And you know what's on everyone's mind? Pumpkin spice. Perfect. Pumpkin spice. I think it's food. It's not like any food I ever saw. I'll try it. Pumpkin spice. Mm -hmm. I never thought I'd taste anything better than worms and algae, but this is amazing! This wiener tastes just like a Krabby Patty! Maybe we can add them to the menu! I'm not impressed. Pumpkin spice. Now I'm impressed! Ah, oh, blueberry wings. Such a treat! Pumpkin spice. Huh? This was supposed to be bread. This was supposed to be soup. I don't even know what this is supposed to be. Pumpkin spice. <laughs> Pumpkin spice. Well, maybe not. 
Here's six super fun things you can do now that you don't have a job. Number one, go for a spin with your friends. That looks like fun. Number two, play catch at the beach. What a hoot. Number three, get a whole new look. Frankenstein's dreams. Number four, upgrade your mobile gadgets. I upgraded your smartphone to a fart phone. Sounds good to me. Number five, work on your belching skills. <laughs> <laughs> nice work, guys. And number six, discover the real you. At last, I have found my calling. I am Patrick Pan, defender of Bikini Bottom. <laughs> Villains beware. So what do you think, SpongeBob? Are you ready to have some fun? Holiday tune from Nick. Are you ready to rock? Let's pop this sucker! What's going on out here? Ring out the bells, play all the shells, sponges on your bread. When you're there, it's Christmas time. Holiday rhymes fall on the tree. Christmas is here. You're being naughty this year. All right, let's make like a gift and wrap it up. Bring out the wings, holiday things, ginger and beef, fruit cake, honey, crate, all the snow, 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 breathe, like you lost, rock out with us, Nick, let's get a singing, get a hear all about the ringing, go! <laughs> what are those Neanderthals up to? <laughs> Find my book or happiness. Wait, my turn! Not just one, the one with the accent. Somebody has to get punched. Ow! 
Oh, the frazzled one. Don't forget Carson. My name is Paul. Right. Harvey's dad, not to be confused with Harvey's... Mother! Right, mother. Let's kick his town's butt. Harvey's cute baby sister. Randall oh. and his mom. Randall's fake mom. Who's ready to be unconditionally loved? Harvey's dad's friend. If you're thinking she's my girlfriend, you're right on the money. Harvey's dad's friend's girlfriend. Les Quirrell. Here we are. That's French. A horrifying ghost. How dare you. The really big deal author. This old guy. An inexplicably alive finger. Okay, parking round. The shocking one. The illiterate one. I can't read. The one with headphones. The angry one. The one that's cool. The stylin' one. The doctor. The friendly one. And these guys. Nailed it. Now you know every character in Big Bark Woods. Pick up the night mate. We know that's you, Harvey. Epic Split. Featuring Craig. I've had my ups and upchucks. My fair share of sudden death wings and pumping in Sanjay's face. That's what makes me what I am today. Now I stand here before you. What you see is a snake that has just been triple dared. A triple dare engineered to defy the laws of physics and like nature's math, man. And a radness to do the most awesomest of splits. Ow. <gasps> Come on, Red. This triple dare was set up to demonstrate the precision and luxury of having a butt with two legs. Ah! Dude, <laughs> that was awesome. Epic. Wanna get very healthy?
great. We share them with the monkeys and with the apes. You can grab, you can tie, you can pinch your cheek, but without your thumbs, you're all thumbs. All thumbs, no thumbs. Bust it up your thumbs. Suck it on your pinky, we'll shoot a thumb. You never get to ride or pull out a plum. Without your thumbs, you're all thumbs. Thumbs, thumbs, thumbs. All thumbs, no thumbs. Feels like a crime. Can't pull on a zipper or flip a dime. And forget about chopsticks, you'll starve every time. Without your thumbs, you're all thumbs. Dance like a chump. All right. Well, why not dance like a chimp? Or even better, a king. Oh. Yeah. Let the Lord of the Lemurs show you how at King Julian's Royal Dance Academy. Uh, uh. Everybody loves the king that is me. See why the whole animal kingdom is hopping. Let's dance. Want to learn a move? They'll teach you that groove. The mama. Oh, yeah. The moonwalk. Outstanding. The Egyptian. Oh. The electric noodle. Join the academy and you'll pop like a pop star. Rock the house. Cut a country rug. Yeah. And even learn to polka. German folk music. And that's not all. Join now and he'll teach you acorn style. <laughs> I got to make a dono, huh? I got to make a dono, huh? Oh. King Julian's Royal Dance Academy. It is awesome just like me. It's the only way to boogie like a king. My booty's poop. You can never get too many thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. You guys are stupendous customers. Huh? It's like there's a thumbprint of happiness on my aorta. <laughs> That's right. See Fun Wanda join the crew as they save the planet. Why don't we make tomorrow's concert a benefit to preserve the Earth's oceans and Gardenia's beaches? You're so responsible! Blah, blah, blah! Where did that come from? I'm Fun Wanda! I'm loving this! Witness Fun Wanda meet the guys. Ladies, we have arrived. Too traditional. Too French. Too Tom Cruise. Ah! Now that's the most gorgeous I've ever seen. What's going on? I'm not sure. I'm Fun Wanda! I'm loving this! And watch Fun Wanda help fight the trash. Give up, Winks. You're done. Yes, Fun Wanda is loving the Winx Club. But can the Winx Club survive Fun Wanda? I didn't say it was going to be easy. Like, whatever. Let's see, take auditions. Okay, this is Amber for the role of Patrick Star. Take one. And action. Will there be nachos there? <laughs> a little, 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 little. Let's try that again, but dumber. Okay, Jack, you're an evil genius bunny. And action. Curses! Okay, let's try that again. Curses! One more with feeling. Curses! Did someone get this guy a carrot? Give me Ditsy Giggle. <laughs> People call your people. Parrots! On the next Fairly Odd Parrots, will Cosmo learn to shake his booty? Cosmo, what are you doing? I'm getting jiggly with it! Get, get, get jiggly with it! Does Wanda ever stop chewing on her new wand? I can't hear myself, but I'm craving! <laughs> and will the Fairly Odd Parrots finally meet their match? Ah, it's Crocker! That's right! Can you get an F for Fuju? Please be a plant eater! Please be a plant eater! Find out first time on Wiki Parrots! Arr, it's time for Gary's Holiday Sing Along! Whatsoever. <laughs> one brave sponge. I'm not interested in anything you're selling! And one not so bright star. <laughs> Who's SpongeBob? <laughs> Who's SpongeBob? We'll defy the odds. <laughs> Find strength within. Patrick, look at that! But you know I'm allergic to jumping! You know that! Train in a montage. 
and achieve wild success. <laughs> or almost certainly fail. In Jellyfish and Impossible. This movie will not be coming to a theater near you because, well, it's fake. Maybe it is stupid, but it's also dumb. If you want to be fancy, hold your pinky up like this. The higher you hold it, the fancier you are. There is no right or wrong when it comes to that stuff, SpongeBob. There just either is or there isn't. You got it set to M for Minnie, but it should be set to W for Wumbo. Just do what I do when I have problems. Tree! Once there was an ugly particle. He was so ugly that everyone died. Yeah, you may be an open book, SpongeBob, but I'm a bit more complicated than that. The inner machinations of my mind are an enigma. Wumbo. We should take Bikini Bottom and push it somewhere else! Sometimes we have to go deep inside ourselves to solve our problems. You always give a joking victim the slime like maneuver first. If that doesn't work, you walk away and pretend like you never saw them before. <laughs> Even just painful! Apology? The study of Wumbo? It's first grade, SpongeBob! Your favorite psychic sea star is back! It's time for another round of Ask Patrick Anything! I see all! Except for when I'm watching TV, because then I just see TV. Let's try asking a question together. Patrick, is the weather going to be nice this weekend? All signs point to yes. See, he knows everything. Now it's your turn to think of a question. Yes, you. Got one? Ask it now. Definitely 100% yes. Wait, did I say yes? I meant... Away! What a decisive answer! Ready for another question? Ask away! The answer is underpants! Underpants on boats and underpants on toast and it... Hold on. Can you repeat the question? That's deep. Now, viewers, think of a really important question. Are you ready? And ask. I'd like to answer your question with another question. Do you? By any chance, have a sandwich I can borrow. Well, Patrick, that's not really an answer. You try answering questions on an empty stomach. Listen to him. Okay, well, until next time, this has been Ask Patrick Anything. Patrick, let's get you something to eat. A snack in the hand is worth two in the fridge. Right you are, Patrick. Right you are. Say it, Fred. No. Say it. <laughs> Right.